carving program is a fantastic one and I tell the guys all the time when they come in even if you don't know how to carve you can learn how to carve while you're here so that you can have that once you go back home and there's a sense of connection to the land and their own sort of spiritual self when they do the carving the men come together and they share culture they share stories the the work that they create is true art one of the first things we did, along with bringing in some Inuktitut speaking staff and elders, was to create a carving program which started initially at uh, Beaver Creek. We've had some world-class carvers come through here. Some, some unbelievably, unbelievably talented carvers. You can watch them sharing uh, their techniques, sharing their skills, and then there'll be silence, and then they'll talk about a story of when their grandfather or their father or their uncle took them hunting, and the, their, their carvings take on the life that is their culture. I'm making a rabbit over here. We have rabbit up there, polar bear, walrus, arctic char, seals. I started carving when I was about 12, 13 years old. I had three year sentence, so I, they sent me here from, uh, from Nunavut. Sometimes I teach the other guys how to do some carvings, and I'm making money out of it. So I would have money when I go back home. It also, in some ways, provides a bit of an economy for them if they're able to sell some of those pieces, contribute back to their families and communities. They're sold on consignment to a, a gallery, so the men get a, a portion of what the carving would be worth. We wanted to facilitate an opportunity that was very Inuit-specific in the way that they could continue to be connected to their, their culture and they do it together, which is also very, very important. They, they form a community within our institutions so that they can feel that connection even though they're so far away from home. To have an Inuit, all, all, nothing but Inuit in here in the cap carving program, it's like, I like it. Uh, we talk to each other so in our own daddy. I think it's great that CSC is recognizing that one of the most identifiable Canadians, Inuit, uh, do have some say in how their, their programming and healing goes in the institutions.